Welcome back to the mix, y'all. So we're here with the beautiful and talented Miss Regine Carter. So let's just get right back into it. So Regine, I saw on Instagram your dad wishing you a happy early birthday. It's coming up on November 29th. So happy birthday from all of us. Yes, happy birthday. Yeah. Happy, birthday. Yeah. happy early okay, birthday. Early birthday. What you got plan for your birthday? What you got going on? Okay, so mind you, I don't know if y'all really know, but I've been doing big parties since I was like one years old. I'm really big on parties. So I feel like this party is going to be bigger than like my other parties because, you know, I'm doing it for the 9, 9 and the 2000s. And I was like one, two years old. So, <laughs> you know, this is going <laughs> to be something. But um, basically, you know, I'm just doing a hot boy, hot girls thing, you know, bling, bling type of era. And it's going to be lit. And I have Manny Fresh DJing. I just got to say that. Yes. That's like really that, was, that was it. Yeah, that was that's lovely. I love that. Oh, Manny Fresh, the DJ. I love it. I even saw you got billboards in Atlanta. You ain't playing no games. <laughs> yes, no. I def. I got my own billboards around Atlanta because it's like you know, I want people to see me. They have to know it's November. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just a light flex. Just a light flex. You know. Just a light yeah. Flex. yeah, you know, no, some no. billboards. It's nothing. <laughs> Period. <laughs> And that's my first. I love, I love and it. it's awesome. We know your party and your invite list is probably crazy. We saw even Nicki Minaj commented asking for an invite. So we got to get the tea. Who's some people that's making the guest list? Y'all, the mix. And y'all better be there. Let me just tell y'all something. <laughs> Okay. Hey. Look, I just saw my I saw my invite in the DM today. I was I got to go to ATL, y'all. <laughs> yeah. Out there, you know, I'm gonna have a couple people in there, but I just I'm worried about the mix right now. So y'all gonna okay. be oh. you know I'm gonna be in there, big and pregnant, baby. Come on. I'm hoping my water break at the party. Mommy, stop saying that. <laughs> I keep saying that. I really hope that. I just really hope. But you are in a whole party and then I can't go with you and stay in the lobby because I'm probably be drunk, turned. Come yeah, on. Yeah, you could just chill and she. I'll tell you when she come out. Like you don't have Girl, to go. That is my baby. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna Look, get I gotta it. Ask, I remember. I remember you had one of the biggest Sweet Sixteens ever in MTV history. I remember they hit me up. There was like. Yo, Wayne's daughter just shut it down on MTV. So I gotta say, do you think that this party is gonna top that? Because that's that's a classic right there. How could you top what's the top? Yes, I feel like that is this party is because it's just so different and it's so it's like my daddy was a hot original hot boy, and the fact that I'm doing this thing, I just think it's so dope and everybody. Everybody been hitting me up about it. So I just feel like this is going to be it. Let me call my assistant. Y'all know I'm filming a movie, but I got to make it to Reginate birthday. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. And, and tell you, um, you this thing, okay? Make it happen. Yeah, on a movie. He's looking at me. For a period. <laughs> you trying to get the role. <laughs> Who would you want to be in a movie with? I want to know that. Who I, some... I want to be in a movie with? Who would you want to be in a movie with? Um... Shoot, I love Taraji P. Henson, Angela Bassett. Um, work with both of them, amazing, right? Um, who else? I do one more person, a man, Denzel. Mm. Mm. Uh, yeah. Nice little list you got there. I like that list. That list is solid, uh, very talented. Uh, oh, yeah, you know, her list is just so amazing. My girl really wants to ask, so I had to ask. Because I say it's not true. But are you really going to leave me and go to LA with all the lanes? Oh, oh, oh wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> You're not going to disrespect LA like that, baby. <laughs> not you guys. Not you guys. Thank me. Okay, listen. I'm going to be by coastal. I just feel like in LA, you wake up and you want to do something. Sometimes being in Atlanta, it makes you lazy. Everybody just want to party and do all of that. Like, I need to go somewhere where I can go, come somewhere and party, and then go somewhere and work. Yeah, okay. I hear that. I and know. Romeo is here. Period. Oh, so. We're about to pull up on my movies. Wow. We about it's to make Romeo. these movies. 
Nobody can Romeo show reboot. Come on. Cash money and no limit together, baby. Finally, <laughs> it's going down with the next generation. Oh wow, y'all wild out here. Yeah, so you and Romeo might have to fight for Regine from now on. It's right, incredible. like he's going so hard. Like the vibes, man. The vibes. You I need her to be oh, here. Man. Come on, Romeo already knows what's up, man. Exactly. <laughs> You got it. So we got to switch it. We got to switch it to some music talk. Being that Regina's dad is the legendary Little Wayne. Last week, the Jeezy and Gucci Mane verses broke all kinds of records and may have been one of the biggest moments in hip hop. But fans are now calling for a Little Wayne versus Eminem battle. Regina, I want to know what you think of that matchup or who you think your dad should battle. Okay. Um, I'm going to just tell y'all the truth. <laughs> I just feel like. My dad is a Martian, man. It ain't nobody he can battle, man. I mean, I don't lie. I mean, I I feel like the only person that I would say, I can't even say, Jay-Z, what? Like, I mean, I don't know. Like, and again, my daddy won't do that type of stuff. He's just not going to battle. But, like, I feel like, no, man, he... I got to speak. I agree with her on that. Wayne, yeah, I was thinking. Yeah, baby is in a lane of his own. I'm. We won't. We won't have a lot of rappers if it wasn't for him. I see yeah. it literally growing up. You know, I seen it being from down south in New Orleans. The the um the influence he had, and I think a lot of people forget that in this day and age, people don't realize you work your ass off, so you don't have to work as hard when you're older. He don't got to go in the studio and put yeah. albums out no more. But you got to realize the influence that Wayne had. That's not my favorite rapper dead or alive that's my favorite rapper ever and i feel my dad is the greatest hustler rapper i feel that wayne is the most talented and the greatest one of the greatest rappers we ever seen and you got to get a man his flowers for real yeah. so he wanted to go against himself yeah yeah, yeah. No, I was one, other person. one other person what what if what about a wayne and tip battle oh I'm that's dead. entertainment that, yeah, that would just be entertaining. Yeah. This man been trying to like who? First of all, they both Libras, <laughs> right? They, they act alike. Just to, like and that just would be a funny verse. <laughs> that would be a funny verses. Why would it yeah, be? Because they both crazy and they yeah, all. They that's, gonna be, that's gonna be full of hits though. For the that's oh, full of hits yeah. though. That would be yeah. a dope versus like. Yeah, but like I said, my daddy's a Martian. I don't think yeah. nobody can go against him. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. No, I was trying to think of somebody today, and I didn't really see anybody going up against Wayne either. I love Wayne, y'all. Yeah. Everybody know that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not huh? How could you not love Wayne? He's just yeah, I mean, saying like his own style. Like Romeo said, he influenced so many rappers. Like he, in my mind, is just in his own category. Completely. Exactly. I remember y'all, let me tell y'all a story. I remember when he came out with those um, skinny jeans and I was like, daddy, what do you have going on? Like the, the <laughs> jeans is so, so skinny, you know? And then ever since that, everybody be wearing them. Like it's like- yeah, not the same, I am a Martian. <laughs> <laughs> Look, on that note, we got to take a quick break, but Regine is going to be kicking it here with us only on the mix. Keep it locked. We'll be right back.